we are a company that started in iit madras uh, building technology for simulation in vocational training and in the recent past we have uh, been greatly successful not just in india but also in the us with over 500 installations worldwide around 200 in the us and around 300 in india we have been predominantly strong with the private sector where the cost of a mistake coming from incorrect skill has been quite high and this the pain is felt so for many industries we have been able to reduce their uh, costs at the shop floor due to rejections due to rework and mistakes on the shop floor that come from problems with hand skills so skills like welding spray painting blasting sealant application ac repair solar panel technician these are all skills that we have on a multi skill platform so today all of this is in virtual reality we have these stationary as well as portable training simulators that industries and training centers use in the us the uptake has been greater with training centers and we have institutes which have 30 or more simulators in one single place and that's one trend we are now seeing in the indian context also with a training center in pune having 17 of our simulators another training center in odisha having about 10 of our simulators and these are things that we now want to work with the government of tamil nadu and other state governments where the facilities at the iti will have to be upgraded with these xr simulations and uh, on the same set of uh, simulation multiple trades can be learnt by the students this leads to better employability of these uh, students and their earning earning potential goes up by about uh, 40 to 50% and the benefit to the employer also becomes about 60 to 70% more than what it was without using this technology so we started skill very about uh, 11 years back um, and that was a time when the skill gap in india was beginning to get acknowledged as well as the potential for having a demographic dividend the trigger for me personally was to read in the newspapers that the uh, delhi metro had to bring in people from peru to dig the tunnels the delhi t3 airport had to bring in people from china to do the labor work so a country with 1.2 billion population at that point of time with 70% of people in the productive age group why did it have to bring in people from outside so that struck a chord and then me and my co-founder we had this idea about using technology for scaling up the skill ecosystem and and that's how we started building and from day one we spent our time in real factories understanding the real challenges and then building small solutions to testing it in the factories and then finding that there was value delivered at the shop floor level and that helped us stay ahead of the syllabus at any point of time so we always knew what the industry wanted as opposed to what the syllabus was being taught in the schools so we were ahead of the syllabus and therefore it helped to have a lot of industry customers from the very beginning we are very strong with uh, automotive uh, construction sector construct equipment sector and paint sector for example um, tyson group is using our simulators in a big way maruti suzuki is using it in a big way construction equipment companies like uh, jcb and uh, case new holland are using our simulators in the auto sector we have maruti ashok leyland tata hero motors tvs almost all the automotive companies are using it at their shop floor because of the multi skill facility you know inside the factory they need welding painting and sealant application outside the factory they need mostly painting but a little bit of welding in addition to that we also have been working with paint companies like uh, nippon paint asian paint berger paints nerolac paints axo noble and axal in particular with uh, nippon paint they have about 20 of our simulators and they use it in tier 2 and tier 3 towns to upskill the existing painters to use modernized methods of painting like spray painting and uh, i think in the last 6 months they have trained close to 2000 painters and this is an ongoing activity and this uh, i think will change the way painting is done not just from a painter perspective but also from a consumer perspective because if your house has to be repainted it typically takes about a week's time today so you can't stay in the house for one week with this new method of painting it will come down to one and a half to two days so your house is ready for occupation much faster than before uh typically we find that uh, there is at least uh, 40% to 70% training uh, saving on the consumables and other costs involved in training uh, for example if you are training somebody to become a car painter 1 liter of paint is about uh, 3000 rupees 
and therefore you can't train people with real pain um and if at all you do train people with real pain the training is limited to one or two attempts only whereas these are skills that require multiple repeated practice for you to become proficient in that skill so these are areas where with our uh, virtual reality uh simulators the cost of more practice is almost uh, negligible there is no consumable there is no the only little bit of battery electricity is all that is required so the cost comes down for training and because of this better training and analytics that are provided after you train the mistakes made by the student is also much lesser and these mistakes also end up saving about uh, 40 to 50% at the shop floor level for the users of these uh, training simulators so today we are doing well in india us uh, we have just now started in uh, uk also we are seeing a lot of demand from world over we keep uh, getting requests from many countries in africa many countries in south america many countries in europe so we are on one hand expanding geographies to more areas where this is really applicable on the other hand we are adding more and more skills to our multi skills platform so last year we had four skills by the end of this year we'll have six and in five years we'll have uh, 20 skills on the platform so any college or factory investing in this technology will have multiple options to get return on investment